All right, no time for intros. This is a really serious problem. If you text using the wrong form of your, chances are I'm not gonna like you. Let's say that you have to type, you're invited to the party. If you spell it correctly, I have respect for you and I wanna have your children. If you spell it as your no apostrophe, my hatred for you is at 50%. Maybe no one ever taught you the bridge rule. If you don't know which form of your to use, just replace it with you are. And if that works, slap on an apostrophe. This bridges the two words together. The way that you spell your says a lot about your character. If I'm texting you and you hit me with a your, unless you're riding an electric skateboard and selling your company to CNN, I don't wanna hear it. Then again, this is probably why people don't invite me to parties or invite me at all. Recently, I saw a guy having an argument online and he started off by saying, you're stupid with an apostrophe. Let the adults talk. I'm sorry, but if you start off a sentence with your, nothing you say is ever gonna matter. Since I'm an English major, people tend to say sorry if I made any grammatical mistakes when they text me, and I kind of find that hilarious. For example, I'm in a group chat with eight of my friends, well like six friends, an acquaintance, and a guy I'm pretty sure doesn't exist. And every time one of us makes a grammatical mistake, we set that as their nickname. So far we've got conformed, lows, too sensitive, my, <laughs> my attic warrior Gohan, and like four people named Yoi. You'd be surprised how easy it is to type Yoi instead of you. The last person is called Mr. Hernandez because one of the Yois gave him a fake name so he could pretend to be a work reference. The only problem was that he didn't tell him. So one day in the chat, we randomly got a message that read, who the hell is Mr. Hernandez? And that's been his name ever since. Since I've been a part of the Yois, that's our group name, whenever I see someone make a grammatical mistake, I die a little inside. One of my Facebook friends once posted something like, I love Johnny Deep, and I had to physically restrain myself from typing, yeah, I love Johnny Deep too. <laughs> also, I hate it when people use TBH in the text. Do you mean to tell me that you're not always honest with me? That's even worse than people that type out LOL but don't actually laugh. I remember this one time I told a joke to my sister, and that's why you never kick an L, and she verbally responded with LOL. Do you even know what words mean? You're not even laughing out loud. That's why if I ever need to text someone anything, I mean it. If I text you Raffle LMAO, you best believe that I'm rolling on that carpet and my cheeks are gone. Uh, uh, slim shady. I hate it when I'm texting someone and they respond with triple question marks. What am I supposed to do in that situation? What did you not understand? It's right there in text-based form. Why didn't you clarify what you found confusing? Now we're both gonna be late for that awesome Johnny Deep movie. Finally, I need to talk about emojis. Everybody has a spirit emoji. Personally, I like using the emoticon colon P, but I don't spam it in between every word that I say. My personal rule is if you average more than three emojis in a sentence, I will mysteriously disappear from your life. Emojis can't sub Substitute conversation, and I hate it when people send me a string of emojis and I have to make sense out of it. However, I will admit that a perfectly timed eggplant is a great way to end a conversation. <laughs> Everything needs to come with moderation. As long as you text me in a way that makes it understandable for me, then I won't have a problem with it. Unless you use either of these two forms of your, then I hate yoy. As always, don't forget to smash that like button for a thousand years of good luck on all your future English exams, and to share this video with all of your friends if they do any of these things. So if you're someone that doesn't know how to spell your properly and someone sends you a link to this video, all I have to say is, welcome to the deep end, my friend. <laughs> I wrote in laughter in my script, I am a loser. Hope you guys enjoyed this English major ranty video. Uh, subscribe, leave a like. Uh, what do you have to say, Julio? Thanks. What? God? God. Okay.